Hello Aqua Aries and welcome back to my channel. We're doing your next 48. This is episode 24 and 25 for my Aqua Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising and the North Node. If you have questions about getting a reading, you already know what to do. All right, so let's see what's going on. Aqua Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising and the North Node. Please show me the important messages for Aqua. Let's see. All right, Aqua Aries. Okay. Okay, we have the King of Swords. Okay, there's your card right off the bat, all right? I'm getting you're pissed. You look very, you look so angry, all right? Let's see, I'm getting you are. I'm just, I'm, but I'm getting like you're getting, I'm getting like you, I'm, I'm getting like you are not playing any games. I'm getting, I'm getting, I'm getting it's, it's time out for the bullshit. Like for real, I'm getting like you've had it. Yeah, we have the six of cups. It could be with an X. I'm getting, you're tired of being nice. You're tired of being sweet. You're tired of being kind. You're tired of being the good guy. I'm getting, I'm getting it's time out for that shit. Yeah, we have the hangman. Yeah, I'm getting, you're, you're dumb. You're dumb being nice to people or you're done being nice to a certain person. I'm getting, it could be a Scorpio. Yeah, because I'm getting like, I'm getting, maybe you thought that somebody was nice and caring and, and um, helpful, but they're actually not. I'm getting like you're seeing somebody's true colors. All right, because as you can see in the background, it's purple. The purple to me represents enlightenment. It's a holy color, the, the, the color of the, Phoen the Phoenicians, okay? I mean, now you could be, you could be studying phonetics. Maybe you're studying, studying the phonetic alphabet because the King of Swords is also, it's intellectual. It's learning, it's studying, Okay, it's watching something, it's reading something, it's being it's because you are highly intellectual, Aquarius. Okay, so I'm getting you could be studying the phonetic alphabet or the Phoenicians, or maybe you're still maybe you're watching the color purple, or you're looking up something. I'm getting like you're I'm getting like you are enlightening yourself, or you 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 learned something recently that's very enlightening and could be very helpful to other people. So I'm getting you are sharing what you know. You're you're sharing like what you have learned here. Yeah, we have the two of wands. Let's see what else we can pull out. We have the King of Cups, and then we have the Two of Pentacles. Okay, so the Two of Wands to me is taking the high road, okay? So the, the Two of Wands, like you have, you have two decisions. Either you're going to be petty or you're, or you're going to be peaceful. Which one do you want to go with? It looks like you're going to be peaceful, but I'm getting you're still juggling with the idea. You're like, hold on, wait, I tried to be peaceful, but I don't know. I might have to go get in that mode with you. Yeah, so I'm getting like you have to... You may have to sit here and think about how you want to proceed forward with somebody. Like, how do you really want to deal with this person? I'm getting you're going to deal with them in a very professional way, the Aquarian way, cut them off. But I'm getting first, you're going to enlighten yourself about a situation first, and then you're going to act. Okay, because I'm getting like you're, I'm getting you're trying to be peaceful. You're trying to be loving. You're trying to be cordial. But I, I, I kind of feel like somebody is pushing you with this, with, the, with you coming out first like this, the queen of, the king of swords. All right, what's the hangman? What's the hangman? I'm getting like I'm getting like Hebrew, or like okay, yeah. We have the page of wands, yeah. So I'm getting you're sharing information, or you're looking up information about Hebrew, the phonetic alphabet. All right, but I'm getting you are watching something that is super enlightening, like on some deep shit, like some like some occult shit or metaphysical, or you're watching something on like language. All right, really educating yourself. What is the what are you doing, Aqua? What's the King of Swords though? What's the King of Swords? Yeah, we have the uh, Queen of Pentacles. Okay, so you could be dealing with an earth sign. There's an earth sign here next to you. I'm getting it's a Taurus or, you know, it could be Taurus, Virgo, El Capitan. What's the, what's the uh, Six of Cups? Yeah, we have the Three of Pentacles. Yeah, I'm getting you're sharing something online, literally. Okay, this is sharing. So I'm getting like you're sharing vid videos. The Three of Pentacles to me, that's also El Capitan. The Three of Pentacles is apprenticeship. People watching you, it's Facebook, IG, Twitter. It's my, it's my blogger card. The, three, the, uh, the third house is at the House of Communication, blogging, internet, journalism, you know, Gemini, the, 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 the House of Communications. All right. Yeah, so I'm getting you could be learning something about this person through sheer study or... I don't know. It's almost like something that you're reading or studying. It, it gives you like a broader view about somebody that you're dealing with or something like that. Okay. What is, what is this? Let's, let's keep going. Let's see what this is. All right. The two of one. Yeah. We have the hermit. Okay. Yeah. I'm getting, you're studying something here. Are you looking something up? What's the King of Cups? Yeah, we have, ooh, yeah, see, I knew something. Yeah, we have a lot of weird energy in the readings today. 
a lot of a lot of sh something something is about to go down what's the two of pentacles yeah we have the knight of cups yeah i'm getting here dealing with someone who's toxic but i'm getting i'm getting capricorn really really strong what is the what is the king of cups and the uh and the devil yeah, we have the Knight of Swords. See, there's that Gemini energy, Knight of Swords, Three of Wands. There's that three again. So we have Gemini's coming through real strong. Energy, but I'm, I'm getting double Jupiter, three, three communications. Yeah, I'm getting two. You're going to have to act fast. Because the Three of Wands, too, it's like, you know, it's, it's sending something. It's sending emails. It's waiting on emails. The Wands are communications. So I'm getting something at a distance. What is the, what is the, um, I'm getting too, you need to distance yourself from somebody. What is, what is the, uh, Knight of Swords? What is the Knight of Swords and the Three of Wands? Knight of Swords, Three of Wands, please. Yeah, we have the Two of Cups. So yeah, I'm getting like I'm getting like somebody who ghosted you, Aqua. They're gonna reach out to you. What is this? Cause I'm, I'm cause I'm getting like the reason why somebody reaches out to you because you post something online. I'm getting the moment you post something, someone's gonna reach out to you or say something to you. Cause it's almost like you've been ghost, like you have not been online or you're not active on social media that much. But I'm getting like somebody is very surprised to see that you actually, you, you know, you posted something new, you're online. I'm getting somebody rushes to you right away or somebody rushes to text you or communicate with you or DM you like right away when they see that you post something or they see that you have shared something. Yeah, because I'm, I'm getting it's like you, you've been, go, you're, you're a ghost. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm getting like you're not on social media that often at all. But I'm getting as soon as somebody sees that you that you have posted, someone's gonna reach out. Is what I'm getting here. But I'm I'm getting as someone that I'm, I'm getting like with these two cards. Yeah, I'm getting like somebody is not doing it for the right reasons though. What's what is this combination with uh, that devil energy, man? That, it could just be a Capricorn though. I mean, that, it it could be a Capricorn because the two of cups is a very positive energy. So is the three of wands sometimes. Because it's, it's almost like somebody has been waiting on you to post, or you've been waiting on this person. What's the, what is this combination before we move forward? I need to see what that is first. Because it's, it's almost like somebody has been watching you. Like, it, some, somebody has been watching and waiting to see if you're going to post. Because I'm getting you ghosted somebody. You, okay, I'm, it's coming together. I'm getting, your, I'm getting you stop talking to somebody. Like, recently, you ghosted them or you're completely ignoring them. You're dead silent. But I'm getting, like, maybe you have a, a YouTube page or you have an IG page. And someone's, like, somebody is, like, desperately watching your page to see when you post something. I'm getting as soon as you post a video, as soon as that video uploads or that 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 post that this person's going to reach out to you, like, I don't know, in, like, desperation or some shit. What's the, what is this combination? What's the, what is this uh, combination right here? Yeah, we have the Five of Wands and the Emperor. Yeah, some, yeah but they on some bullshit, though. Yeah, because yeah, these two cards, it's like somebody wants to argue, somebody wants to fight, somebody wants to bicker, somebody wants to bring up old shit. Like some, somebody wants to somebody wants to start a fight with you. Somebody wants your attention. So I'm getting yeah, I'm getting like somebody has been trolling you like every single day, waiting for you to post. What's the six of cups and the three of pentacles? And I'm getting as soon as you do, they're gonna reach out to you, hella messages. But I'm getting, it's, it's like somebody wants to pick, they want to fight, they want to, you know, they want to know why haven't you been messaging me, why didn't you get back to me, I see that you're online, what's up, like, but I'm, get, I'm getting like still just ignore them, because I'm getting like somebody's very toxic energy, vampire, something, yeah, somebody like wants you back, or like somebody, I don't know, what's the six of cups and the three of pentacles? Yeah, the eight of swords, like somebody has, yeah, that's what I'm saying, somebody has been watching your page. Like going in circles, wondering like, where'd you go? Why, why'd you disappear? Why'd you stop talking to me all of a sudden? Okay, this could be someone that you met online, but I'm getting like, you know this person in person. Yeah, because I'm getting like, somebody's going to reach out to you because they want to bitch and moan. And I'm getting, you're still going to be in promote. Yeah, somebody is stuck on you. Yeah, I'm getting, you left, you left somebody stuck. What's the, what's the Eight of Swords? This is the Eight of Swords. Yeah, the Nine, yeah, somebody is shook, man. Somebody is shook. Somebody is shook. What, what is this combination? I'm getting to like somebody feels guilty. So I'm getting that. I'm getting that's why you're ignoring this person. Because yeah, 
something is something that they did. It could be a Gemini. This is awesome, but this could be you though too. But I'm not I'm not getting it you. I'm getting it's a Gemini energy. Yeah, because that this is Gemini. The, the the first and second we have the um we have the first and second deacon of Gemini here. Yeah, because so the moon is in Gemini right now. I thought I, I think I told Taurus it was in they, it was in their sign, but I, I'm getting the moon is in the first. It'll be in the first deacon of Gemini by you know by tomorrow or whatever. Yeah, that's the eight of swords energy, feeling stuck, feeling smothered, going in circles, not being able to get something off your mind, feeling mentally trapped. This is like dark night of the soul type shit. Somebody is feeling guilty as hell about what they did to you. I'm getting like somebody, maybe somebody left you stuck. Somebody was supposed to help you, but they left you hanging. And now they feel guilty because you, you won't talk to them or you keep ignoring them or like you just, you just won't give them the, the time of day at all. No communication, period. You're dead to me. All right, what's the eight of cups and the nine of swords? Eight of cups. I'm getting like somebody somebody fucked up real bad. I'm getting it's the last straw for you. Somebody knows that you're done. It's over. All right, let's see. What's the eight of swords and the nine of swords? Eight of swords and the nine of swords. I want to see why, you know, why is this person feeling like this though? What's up? Like, why are they feeling guilty? Okay, what's the eight of swords and the nine of swords, please? Yeah, because the yeah, because what they something they did to you in the past, the seven of pentacles high priestess. Yeah, so I'm getting like somebody's watching your videos or it's almost like somebody feels guilty. But like somebody knows that you're intuitive. I'm not really sure what they did to you, Aqua. Maybe they lied to you or I'm getting somebody left you hanging. But what is the seven of pentacles though? What did they, I'm, what did they do? Like what is the seven of pentacles? All right. Because I'm getting you just have somebody waiting and waiting and waiting. Maybe somebody had you waiting. All right, what's the seven of pentacles, please? The seven of pentacles. Yeah, we have the moon card. Yeah, okay, like, I need more clarity. Come on, guys. Like, I'm, you're not giving me nothing. Like, something is, yeah, something, I'm getting to, like, something is, maybe somebody was keeping secrets from you or somebody lied about something or a secret came out about somebody. Yeah, I'm getting, I'm getting you intuitively new already, though. Yeah, so I'm getting, like, yeah, something, a secret came out about someone, a secret came out about a mistress or some shit like that. I'm getting you know somebody's secret and they they know that you know. And that's why they shook like that. What's the moon card? What's the moon? Yeah, the yeah, the page of cups. And the yeah, the world. That shit is done. You done, we done with that shit. What is this combination over here? Yeah, someone's gonna try to, you know. Hi, hi, Aqua Aries. You know what's going on? I'm getting, I'm getting no, no words, nothing. You don't get, you don't, you don't get shit from me. No energy at all. Nothing. You don't, you don't get, you don't get no words from me. Period. And I'm getting, I'm getting this person, and I'm getting like you're literally killing somebody by not, if you, especially if it's a Gemini. Gemini's hate to be ignored because Gemini rules communication. They hate when you ignore them. Okay, I'm getting if it's not a Gemini sun, it's, it's somebody with heavy Gemini pit placements, Jupiter rising or the or uh, the moon. All right. Yeah, I'm getting you're gonna just keep ignoring them, and I'm getting I'm getting like you're posting online and shit, but you're not saying shit to them. I'm getting that's killing them. Yeah, yeah, we have the uh, we have the King, Queen of Wands, and Seven of Swords. Yeah, they lied to you. Period. Yeah, I'm getting like somebody lied to you, or somebody plotted against you, or what's this? What's the King of Wands, Seven of Swords, or somebody was like sneaking around with your friend or some shit? What's the Queen of Wands and the Seven of Swords? But I'm getting somebody was doing something sneaky with another person, obviously a mistress, or I'm getting somebody met somebody online. And like, you know that they're messing with this person. It could be a friend of yours because the three of pentacles is like like-minded people. It's friends. It's fellowship. All right. Yeah. What's the, what's the, what's the queen of wands and the seven of swords? And I'm getting like, somebody knows that you know about that shit and they should, yeah, the six of swords and we have the empress. Yeah. I'm getting to like, somebody knows that you're moving the hell on. Like you've moved on to be with somebody else. It could be a Libra or a Taurus. All right, but I'm getting, you're just moving on to a, here's your card again, Aqua, Aqua Six of Swords, spiritual guides, invisible friends, all right, an ally. I'm getting, you're being led away. I'm getting, I'm getting your guides are saying, don't say shit. Don't, don't talk, Aqua, don't say shit. I'm getting your guides are telling you what to do. Don't say nothing. Let us, let us, let us show you which way to go. We're going to take you out of here. It's going to be easy. You, you're going to be cool. You're going to be comfortable, comfortable. You're going to be comforted. I'm getting, you're being comfort, comforted by your guides. Yeah. I'm getting you're being led to a better life or just a better situation, comfortability. And like somebody, somebody knows that you're, you're, you're gone. You're moving on. All right, what's the, what is the Empress? What is the Empress? Because I'm getting maybe somebody was, 
I don't know. I'm getting like somebody wanted to be like your your counterpart, but you're like, nah, you lie too much. Okay, what's the um yeah, we have the Six of Pentacles and we have the Ace of Pentacles. Yeah, you're going to be fine, though. I'm getting in other news. You're being patronized. I'm getting you're very creative. I'm getting people are paying you for your creativity. But I'm getting like you're, you're relocating. Yeah, you, you have a new opportunity to move or to get away from this situation. Yeah, we have double sixes here. The six is, yeah, six is ruled by Venus, Venusian, Lucifer. All right, Venus, Venus means Lucifer. Yeah, look it up. All right, I know my shit, like, for real, for real. Yeah, sixes. Okay, so the sixes represent gifts. Here it is. Here's your gift from the universe. Why? Because six is a pregnant number. It's pregnant. So I'm getting somebody could be pregnant, like somebody cheated on you and got somebody pregnant, and they know that you know about it, but I'm getting that's cool because your gifts are coming too. All right, what is this combination over here? I'm going to use the whole deck on it. All right, let's see. What's this combination over here? Yeah, the seven of wands. Yeah, no, no words, nothing. You're dead to me. I'm getting, I'm getting you block this person, or you just, like, you're just ignoring them. Period. Like no words, nothing. I'm getting, I'm getting your, I'm getting something is being blocked. Yeah, we have the ten of cups. Yeah, you don't get no words from me. I'm not saying shit to you. Nothing. Like I'm getting, I'm getting all somebody wants you to do what somebody wishes that you would communicate. You're not gonna say anything and don't. Seven of yeah, the nine of pentacles. Yeah, I'm getting you're deciding to be single. It's over. Your day. I'm getting somebody knows that you're done. Okay, what's this combination? Two of Pentacles and the King of uh, Knight of Cups. Yeah, the Will of Fortune, a shift. And what's the Will of Fortune? The Eight of Pentacles. All right, yeah. So I'm getting your focus on your work, but I'm getting something is going to work out. I'm getting two. Something is going to shift in your daily routine or something's going to shift with your job if it has not already shifted. Yeah, we have the Judgment card. Yeah, I'm getting a call. Yeah, we have the Death. Yeah, something is about to something is about to change like majorly with your job, with your work. I'm getting it's going to be a good thing though, a good a good shift with the with these with this beautiful shit coming out right here. All right, because I'm getting like somebody really played you, like, or somebody was trying to. Okay, what's the death card? Yeah, the two of swords. Yeah, you may have to make a tough decision here or an executive decision, but I'm getting it's not going to be an issue for you. Yeah, I'm getting, I'm getting a decision is being made. Someone's going to call you and say, okay, yeah, we have the, the king of pentacles. Yeah, we have the full card. I'm getting you're leaving. You're moving out or relocating at, at the, like the drop of a hat. Yeah. Yeah, I'm getting you're leaving a situation that's been very stressful or burdening you in some way. Like this is, this is done. The cycle is over with this person. I'm getting, there's nothing else to say. Like we're done here. Like it's, that's it. With case closed. It's over with. Yeah. But I'm getting you're going to be okay. Yeah, I'm getting it's a Capricorn. I'm getting it's like somebody knows that this is, you're, you're done. That this is, it's over with. The world card, the cycle is over. The world card is Saturn to me. They're, Saturn is, you know, Capricorn is ruled by Saturn. Okay. Yeah, we have Saturn in retrograde until September 18th. Yeah, so I'm getting, I'm getting this, this cycle with this person. That's, it's a done deal. Yeah, it's over with. They know that shit. Yeah, I'm getting like something is going on with somebody's wife or spouse or somebody's definitely pregnant over there. All right, but I'm getting something is being given to you. You're getting assistance or you're getting a handout. Okay, what's the, um, okay, guys, I mean, ancients. Yeah, we have foresight. Yeah, I'm getting you saw this coming. Yeah, somebody has been uh, very fickle towards you, a liar, you know, back and forth in and out. Somebody has been very unstable with you. I'm getting somebody makes a lot of broken promises towards you and shit like that. People don't, some, this person does not keep their word. Yeah, so I'm, I, I'm getting somebody does not keep their word. I'm getting, you are going to get confirmation of this reading or you're going to get confirmation of this person. Like you're going to, you're going to know who it is. I'm getting you, I'm getting you are going to know because you're going to, it's going to be confirmed. Yeah, somebody is, somebody is not authentic. Somebody is a liar. Somebody does not have your back like that. Yeah, we, and we, I'm getting you know that though with the foresight, uh, Aqua Aquarius, your, uh, your motto is I know, therefore I am the 11th house. That's your motto. All right, so I hope this helps you. All right, don't forget to like the video, leave your comments, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye.